This episode of Drama Queens is brought to you by My Turn, the debut novel by Nathan Seven Scott. Go buy your copy today. Like Liza Minnelli says, It's terrific. You already know, this episode of Drama Queens is rated NSFW. That's not safe for work. So if you feel about it, about it, and you just got to have it, I suggest you turn that volume down real low and check frequently over your shoulder. Now, uh, enjoy the show. Previously on Drama Queens. I can't believe I've been set up. I didn't want to believe. What were you doing on the site? Lance told me. What the fuck was Lance doing on the site? What the fuck were you doing on the site? I just broke up with my boyfriend a couple weeks ago, so I'm not really I looking mean, at it. I that, mean, that, that's cool, that's cool. Like, you know, chill, it's not that deep. I'm just, just trying to chill, you know? Like, you have a cell phone or something? Let me give you my number. I'm glad you came. Seriously, whenever I'm depressed, the, my favorite thing to do oh, is to distract myself with other things. Yeah, <laughs> I see. Can I get your number? No. Davis is here for you guys. Do you understand that? He doesn't have to be here. There are a lot of people who aren't. Hi, mister. That speech today was hot. See, I told you. You have a gift. Consider volunteering. You won't regret it. I'm taking you back to the shelter now. It's my hot body and I do what I want. you. Fuck you! No, fuck you! Guys, please! So like, for every beginning, there is an end, and we all know that, but like, what we don't know is like, what happens after? You know, what's the logical next step? Um, what lies hereafter? Oof. That's deep. I just, I thought you were... Don't you dare try to pin this on me. Pin it on you? Bitch, it's already been attached! Oh, that is such a Jeremiah thing to say! What, the truth? Comedy, pure comedy, comedy! Guys, if you keep fighting, I'm gonna leave. Leave, bitch! I don't do verbal abuse. And I hadn't a clue as to what was going on. There was so much venom in the air, I... I couldn't breathe. Mm -hmm. Did you try an inhaler? I just, I don't understand why you'd go behind my back like that. I just, don't you put it like that. Don't you dare put it like that. How dare you put it like How that? How dare you question my phrasing? How dare you phrase it like that in the first place? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened. What did he tell you? Nothing. Nothing. Yes, nothing. Look at me. He told me nothing. Then what's this? <laughs> this, <laughs> this is a lesson in sexting. With Photoshop being what it is today, intimacy just isn't what it was. Photoshop. Yes, I mean, look at this. He didn't even erase your stretch marks. Why didn't he erase your stretch marks? Oh, oh God, we need to get you to the gym this winter. I mean, if you got it, flaunt it. More power to you, darling. Fierce. So you've never seen this before? I've seen it before. I'm barely keeping my eyesight now. How can I see this thing twice? Somebody saw it. Nobody saw it. Ugh, get away from me. Nobody saw it. Jeremiah Juice! Queens, Queens, bring the madness and the mayhem. News at 11, bro, okay?
So sometimes there are no logical next steps, you know, like sometimes there are. Like when you wake up in the morning, you should brush your teeth. Or when you take a poo, you should probably- Hush now. But you know, what if there are no logical next steps? Yeah, yes. No, I don't follow. So um, how did you end up here? Okay, Pierre, so basically what had happened was... I'm glad you came. So, Jeremiah told you? Told me what? About why we ended? <laughs> I don't know. What kind of friend don't know? The kind of friend that understands that Jeremiah's relationships are between him and his man. I don't intrude. Unless necessary. Well, sometimes it's very necessary. You just don't know. <laughs> Believe me, if Jeremiah needed my help, I would know. So, where's the stuff? What is this shit? And that's all that happened. Ooh, Yamramanya! You seem a touch skeptical, girl. So tell me, what's the skinny? What's the tea? What's going up? Hmm? The phone call. Yes, the phone call. Fill me in, home girl. Well, basically. Davis? Help me, Jesus! Where are you? I am on Rockaway Boulevard. Rock a who? They took my shirt and my wallet and they vandalized me. Well, get your ass on the train. Bitch, you me the first time they took my wallet. Okay. Just listen, get on the A train and come all the way to Rockaway Boulevard. Hurry! And try and find Preston. I've been calling him all day, but he hasn't been picking up his phone. Hurry! Oh, so you called Preston several times before you called me? Nice to know that I'm the sideline, huh? Do you really think that this is an appropriate time to- Hello? Hello? Please insert oh. 25 cents for another three minutes. <gasps> Where do you think you're going? Well, Frankie, I have to um go find one friend and fetch another. Mm. Sounds like fun. <laughs> Morning, bro. <laughs> so your friends must be really important to you, huh? Yes. They're my sisters. Good to know. Yes, it is good to know. Mm. Stop being such a sass. Well, I can't help it. <laughs> Morning, bro. <laughs> so, um... You coming back tonight? Doubtful. I think I need to go take care of some other business and come back tonight. I'll, um, I'll go do my fine and fetch, and then I'll I'll call you. Okay. Alright. Cool. Yes, 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 the find and the fetch. Now, we know where you were, Monsieur Roberts. But how about you, Monsieur Mills Three? Where was you, hmm? Missionary work. We should scoot over before the lightning strikes. Uh-uh, Preston. Just because you were laying on your back doesn't mean that you're doing missionary work. Preston, what's the tea? Fill me in, homegirl. Come on. What had happened was... You need to be quiet, you zero, you nothing, you loser. And you need to come with me. Leave him be. What's wrong with you? Oh, fuck this shit. Now you go leave us alone. Go clean yourself up. And you. Holy fuck. It's a good one, right? Now you know you need an ass whooping. I wouldn't hurt you. I'm taking you back to the shelter right now. I can't. It's past check-in. 
And why did you miss the check-in? Because I had a plan to make some coins and have a place to stay tonight, but you ruined both of them. So now you owe me. Scoozy? I can't stand you talking ass niggas. Ah, uh -uh. we don't use that kind of language, young lady. It's all talk and no follow through with you niggas. Why don't you just give me some money for this evening and I'll be on my way? Or I got work to do. See, I was left with very little choice. Let's go. I had to bring him back to our place for the evening. You see, I believe the children are our future. Teach them well and let, let them lead the way. Show them all the beauty they possess inside. No, y'all didn't. No, y'all do not fuck with Whitney, okay? Not on Pierre's watch, okay? I love each one of you, but no, don't do it. So, I think that the people with the inquiring minds want to know, uh, how did you get here? Well, okay, I'll go back to the beginning. No, no, you don't even know the beginning. I, I, I know, know, I know the beginning. I'll go back to the beginning. Get a job, you bum. Fuck you, buddy. Don't worry, guy, it gets better. Sir, I promise you that I am not homeless. I... Cupcake man. It's Elijah. What are you doing all the way out here, Cupcake Man? I live out here. The real question is, what are you doing out here? Well, nothing. I guess I was just robbed and vandalized. I see. Here. Thanks. I'm glad to help. Oh my god, I'm so worried. Oh my god, thank you for coming. I guess I'll be... No, no, no. Um, Cupcake Man, this is my best friend, Jeremiah. What's up? Hi there. Um, Jeremiah, this is Cupcake Man. Elijah. Well, Mr. Cupcakes, and what is your discount exactly? It's 5%. 5%, is that legal? You fat bitch! Oh my god, baby! I'm fine, I'm fine. I took good care of him. Scooby? Oh, Preston, this is Cupcake Man. Well, 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 Mr. Cupcake. It's only a 5% discount, girl. Oh. On that note, I gotta get to school. Stop by and see me sometime. Stop giving a googly to old 5% Cupcake and tell me what happened. Oh. What happened? Oh, let me help you with that. No, 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 it's okay, I got it. Don't be embarrassed, it's fine. I'm such a klutz myself, aren't I, booby? I think the man's okay. Um, we should respect his wishes. Right, baby? Right. Okay. <laughs> Have a good day, guy. Night. sleep on the train and I really can't talk about this right now. I have to get to my audition. My agent is going to kill me. Sounds like you had a long, hard, rough night of partying. That's dangerous for somebody your age, isn't it? Who's she? And what is he doing here? Excuse you? Jeremiah, this is Tranny Boy. Oh. With an I. Oh, you're Jeremiah. You have a really low thread count. You should upgrade. He was in my bed? Uh-uh. Check for your belongings. Dust for fingerprints. Stop it. Uh, you girls are wearing me out. Seriously. I think all the little chicklets out there want to know how did their fight begin? It was a clear case of deception. Treachery. Deception. I already said deception. Uh-huh. So basically. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Lumi D. 
Local ninja. Uh huh. Spanish Harlem. Stand up. Let's bring it back. Old school loving. On the block Hello. Hey. To the sky, best the money on the joint. Had me feeling like a sensei, and I must say, say, say. Uh huh, let's get it. Beat is raised high, got me feeling so right. Looking in your eyes, though I might just die. Shy, no lie, right? You really should keep a better eye on your youths. You really shouldn't be hanging out with them outside of here. I could report you in your volunteering career. Oh, really? You would do that? <laughs> Look at you, you must think that you're all that Cause you are, and, 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 and I love that Tuesday had me waiting at the park Friday had me flying off to Mars Flying with the stars I can do for a glam for a stare Crush to the days ain't there Hold it to the summer days here Yeah, something's up <laughs> Really, me I've never seen you so loose and free Perfect for the character Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> See you here for callbacks. So it's a deal. I won't report you for harboring Tranny Boy. And you'll be here at 11 a.m. every morning to help. Until grad school starts. Until grad school. It's a deal. I'll see you tomorrow. Looking forward to it. Wasn't trying to mack him, wasn't trying to grow now. Still keep in his fashion, caught up in the moment. Got up on my grown life. I proceeded, uh uh, uh uh, on him. Asked him for the digits, he was all with it. Told him I don't want to own him, I just want to phone him. Hey, um. Did Davis tell you anything or text you or? Other than his usual fuck you fat bitch. No. Okay. Why, what's, what's up? up? Nothing, he um. <sighs> hey guys. <laughs> Davis, what happened last night at Donovan's apartment? Um, excuse me? And why didn't you tell us you were going? Wait, wait. Why am I being vandalized again? Vandalized? I was doing you a favor. Behind my back. Have you seen this? Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Fuck you. Fuck you! No, fuck you! Guys, please! Yeah, 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 we got that now. Chasse to the end. Okay, so we go outside and... 21 years old? A 30 waist? Girls, please! Why would somebody do something like this? Clearly it's a lie and it was Donovan. No, no, listen, listen, listen. I'm no Donovan enthusiast, but the person who did that, that takes a lot of effort and commitment. I mean, I don't think Donovan has that in him. Besides, I don't think Donovan wants to hurt you. That's surprising. Look, girls! We got his paper bag. He done left fingerprints and all. He is so dumb. He is really, really dumb. For real. So, you came here to the copy shop located at 746 30th Avenue between the Story Boulevard and Didmars to investigate. That's really, really smart. Sir, all I really want to know is do you know who this man is? Let me think, let me think. He's a white boy, he had a jacket on, he has some glasses, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. No. What? I'm so confused. Is that a yes or a no? I don't know her! Well, have you seen this? Now, now this I do know. There was some boy in here earlier making the copies. Was he a Latino? <sighs> I don't categorize people like that. But he was of the taco-eating variety, to put it in the more PC terms. Do you know who it is? You know, sometimes when you think something's over and you're working on forgetting and moving on or, or just moving on and you think you're moving forward or sometimes backwards, you stop and realize that sometimes 
There's no moving. What is he talking about? You stay in motion and you keep trying to move past something, moving past something, and you keep thinking it's over, it's over, and then, and then there's days like today and you, and you just notice that it'll never end. It won't be over. Well, who did it? It was Lance. He's in Donovan's show. Isn't the more important question, why? <laughs> why? I threw myself into the spotlight, and things were fine, and I was all right. Made you laugh aside about my life, opened up to see that it was my fight. On the verge to purge into the moonlight, it occurred that love was on my side. I survived, came alive that night, till I arrived, saved my life that night. I threw myself into the spotlight, and things were fine, and I was all right. Made you 